got rejected or waitlisted from most of my East Coast schools. And I'm an East Coast baby, but I got accepted to all the West Coast schools. So like you, oh, yeah. you, you, you never know. How do you feel now that you've moved into your dorm in college? I feel great, you know, I'm from the East Coast, so it's like the weather there's look like night east coast weather is fine the south sucks it's like really humid it's also like i'm from north carolina i didn't really like the you know no city kind of vibes to it so mm -hmm. i really did want to move to like big city cities like new york la san francisco so i'm like very fortunate and very lucky that San Francisco is like 20 minutes down the road what is something you learned about yourself during the college application process <laughs> I took AP Lang while in senior year. So, I was like, I'm going to go like, with the help and the feedback and stuff, I th I've learned that, like, it's not, I'm not that bad <laughs> at writing. That and, like, I've learned about, like, chimis that I'm, like, more into than I thought I would be. Like, especially with, like, my um, being Asian American was definitely, like, a big focal point in my whole, like, Thing. Yeah, I learned how much that meant to me and like I'm actively trying to join another community like that over here at Berkeley even though 40% of the student body is Asian. What, what's the community? Uh, there's CASA here. We have Korean American Student Association and we also have a, um, I think we have an Asian American student. So what was the hardest part about writing your college essays and how did you like overcome it, like your ideas? That's the thing, I didn't know what to write about. That was like my main like big like problem I think. 나의 성격 이 인생을 다 250 word 안에 쓰긴 좀 너무 힘들 것 같아가지고. Yeah, I think that was the hardest part. Finding what to write about to make it interesting for the people to read. How did you try to overcome it? Like, did you like read more books? Like, watch things? Mm, I talked to my parents a lot. 엄마랑 아빠랑 약간 왜냐면 친구들보다 부모님이 저를 대해서 더 아시고 태어날 때부터 여태까지 키웠으니까 성격 뭐 이상한지 뭐 아니면 잘못해서 혼나서 뭐 고쳤던지 약간 그런 것도 있었고 그리고 제가 몰랐던 stuff that I didn't know that I did out of habit. But they're like, oh, you do this. And it's like, oh, and then you just like write about it. It's like stuff like that. Like definitely talking to family is very important, I think, about these things. Yeah, I think so. Because a lot of students don't know, who, like they know who they are currently, but they don't know, like they cannot objectively see who they are from the outside. And because they were so young when they were little, they don't remember those stories. I think there was one time I painted on the walls or something in like very broken Korean. Like I wrote, I wrote like, I, I, 내가 진우야, or like, like on the wall somewhere in like Sharpie. And it was very bad. They had to like rip it's the Sharpie. whole wall. Yeah, they had to rip the whole wall down, put it back up and stuff. That is a very expensive drawing board. I think at some point they just gave up and there was just like Sharpie marks on the wall so, and the like stairs. I <laughs> <laughs> what is one advice you have to high school seniors? Um, don't stress yourself out too much. My goal was to go to New York. That was like what I've been wanting to do. <笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> 네, 저도 이제 약간 아 나도 이제 열심히 해야 되겠다라는 느낌으로 그래서 맞, 맞는 것 같아요 이 대학교가. I got rejected from most of my or waitlisted from most of my East Coast schools, and I'm an East Coast baby, but I got accepted to all the West Coast schools. So like you, oh, yeah. you, 진짜 in, you never know, you know, you just you don't know. 진짜 인생을 모르는 거예요. <laughs>
Yeah, because I know like a lot of kids, especially from now until like they apply an early decision, they're like so focused on their goal and they're so stressed. Like you sh should be stressed. Like if you're not stressed, then something is wrong. But you shouldn't beat yourself over a rejection or beat yourself over a wait list. That's the only like stress I'm talking about. Like Kyoga. Last question. Uh, would you recommend an ICC to other students? Mm, yeah. 저 우리 동생도 하고 있고 저는 약간 좀 늦게 했는데 너무 좋았어요. 선생님도 좋았고 I like that there was like a 단톡방. I like that that was the thing instead of like emailing because like mm -hmm. I don't like writing emails because it doesn't feel one. If you're, it's a college counselor, I feel like you guys should be very personal with each other, especially with like punkyog memories and like chuok katungo. I can't. You have to know each other very well, I think, to be able to help each other. Well, for the counselor to help you. So I very like that there was a group chat and that I could just send something immediately and like be like, hey, this 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 happened. What should I do? Or like, hey, I have this this to write can you give me any ideas like that was very much helpful a lot better than emails i think and ycc is very great i like the experience and i got into all the call most of the colleges i wanted to get into so and you got really lucky after you got it what a soul you see any big tactics on that i was choosing between southern california and cal berkeley but usc is a great school i just think that cal berkeley is better no shade <laughs> <laughs> do you have any like last parting words to like our viewers our parents students for the parents i feel like stay on your kid be very attentive towards it and give them slight reminders like hey this should be due in like a week have you done something about it but like don't like Stay on top of them, like don't be on their backs being like, You guys saw? And though you go, Hey, I see. We're on this, so like most Korean moms and dads are like that, I feel like. And coming from a Kyopo perspective, I very much did not like that kind of <laughs> vibes. So I very enjoyed that my mom was very laid back and chill about the process. So it's very much, um, yeah, that's overreacting, but like, yeah, she was very um, hands off. And with the college decision, too, she was very hands off. At the end of the day, especially with the decisions, too, it's up to your kid and what they want to do. But of yeah. course, you can give your opinion of like, hey, I'm going to go to the university. I'm going to go to the university. It's your choice, you know? But like, don't try to be too pushed onto your kid because he's already very she or he's very stressed already from tests and if they have to take SATs senior year yeah. oh my god SATs APs midterms essays counselor keep up extracurriculars service hours oh my god never again I think that's the worst one year of my life you have okay. no fun until like Christmas break Christmas break. Christmas break it That's it. true. That's yeah. true. SAT though. Oh yeah, another advice. SAT though. I'm not going to tell my score, but if you don't do well on your SAT, don't stress too much. There's the UCs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, who go take a good advice in there? Oh, yeah, my friends keep so. stressing. They're like, "Hey, Kyung, 오빠, 이 SAT 점수 뭐야? 이거 어떻게 나왔어? 어, 어떻게 나이 점수 나왔는데?" Just apply to UCs. If you think your SAT is that bad, just apply to UCs. 유씨가 이 영상을 좋아합니다. <웃음>